What's up everyone? If you couldn't make it to Coffee Tech 2024, don't worry, we've got you covered with our virtual tour. Let's check it out. You'll notice that a big theme this year is we're putting a lot of emphasis on customization, starting here with Elgato Customs. We have the follow-up collaboration that we did earlier this year. We have all of their custom face plates. We're showing off all the different Wave 3 mic skins that you can get. There's so many options. It's honestly, it's getting endless. Here we have the Elgato Neo setup. Basically, it's a much more accessible version of their original products like the Stream Deck, the mic. Everything looks a lot more aesthetically pleasing for the average consumer setup. Everything is much easier to control. Over here, we have the regular Elgato setup, uh, mainly geared towards streamers. Here you can see the prompter where they're showing off their new AI technology that actually recognizes when you're talking and not talking, and it'll move the teleprompter based on that. Here we have the Wave VX and all of the normal Elgato setups that you'll see here, like the Stream Deck Plus, the Key Lights, and uh, the Capture Card over here. Over here we have the Corsair One. Uh, we actually released the metal face plates recently, and along with these, Origin PC is actually starting to release custom front face plates. So these are actually fully textured, uh, and we have a lot of interesting designs, as you can see on the wall here. So yeah, customization, let's keep it moving. Over here, we're showing off all of our new fans, everything from the RX series to the LX, QX, and our PWM fans over there. We have a variety of fans for people that don't really care too much about RGB, along with the good old classic RGB fans, as always. Moving on over, we have new lighting accessories for our builds. Uh, we're going with RGB PSU power strips. So even more RGB for your build can never go wrong with more. And we also have our Aurora strips over here as well. So as you can see here in the build, we have strips going along the tops and bottoms of the case. And then we also have the RGB PSU strips going out. Very pretty, very cool. On to the AIO section over here. We released a new Titan RX RGB AIO and we're showing off a lot of the cool new pump caps that we have. So we have the classic LCD. We also have a fan-mounted AIO pump cap that helps keep the temperatures down. And then we also have the new Groove pump cap. Looks really cool. I'm actually a big fan of this one. Moving on over to our power supply section. This is kind of crazy because this SF1000 is actually the smallest power supply in this form factor for this much power. 1000 watts in this tiny package. I could almost fit this in my pocket, but I won't get into that. We're making our way over to the 9000D. This is a reprise of the original 1000D case. Absolute behemoth of a PC. This setup actually has two computers on the inside. This can hold up to 21 120 millimeter fans. As you can see, they have two reservoirs. They have like four radiators in here. It's, it's absolutely ridiculous. I don't even want to know how much this thing weighs. Here we've made it to a really big focal point in our booth. This is the Corsair Custom Lab section. As you can see, we're releasing tons of different designs of existing IVs that we have, a wide variety of designs, one that can match any flavor, any style that you need for your PC gaming setup. Over here, it's looking absolutely beautiful in this setup. We're rocking like a purple red vibe, a lot of neon. And honestly, I'm very jealous. I'm gonna have to cop some of these for myself for sure. And here we've made it to the scuff section. As you already know, Scuff already does a great job with their custom face plates. They have a ton of them, but their new star of the show is their new mobile gaming controller currently for iPhone. I'm really excited about this personally because I like to game on the go a lot myself, but yeah, super easy to use. Just pops out nice and easy, just like this. So very excited for this one to come out. Moving on over to the drop section now. We already know that drop has a great track record with customization. We have their lovely Lord of the Rings collab that I personally am a big fan of as well. We have all their beautiful keyboards here. This actually really caught my attention. They have a lot of sick artisan keycaps lining the top of their keyboards here. These are actually keycaps too. Love that. And over here, we have the custom tops for all their keyboards. They have carbon fiber. They got brass here. We have gold plated. Like, this is insane. This feels incredibly heavy. This is ridiculous. All right. We finally made it to the star of our show, our brand new sim rig that we're currently developing. We spent a ton of time and effort into this design. It looks absolutely beautiful. And I'm gonna kindly have to ask you to leave me alone because I've been waiting three hours to use this. So, catch y'all next time.